104 days until the Winter Games in Pyeongchang. And every Olympian has a story about his or her journey. Many are worthy of being told over and over again. And then there are those like Eric Lamarck. His story turned from a quest for gold to literally hanging on to life. Aaron Nolan has more on his story in the feature film that chronicles it in this week's Going for the Gold. And the plans that we have for our life at our six foot view are so limited. And Eric Lamarck would know. Eric grew up in California and quickly fell in love with and excelled at hockey. I was fortunate enough to play in the 94 Olympics, which was one of the most memorable experiences of my life. After his career was over, Eric's love shifted from ice skates to snowboards until one day he found himself lost and alone on a mountaintop. Every single day I was beaten to a pulp and then frozen stiff at night. He spent eight days there waiting to be rescued. I met the spirit of death. It gave me nightmares for, for years. After he was finally found, his legs had to be amputated. As you probably can tell, Eric's story of resilience is now hitting the silver screen. Six Below stars Josh Hartnett and Mira Sorvino. Please, you have to find myself. The story is really about survival against all odds, you know, being alone on a mountain in the snow for eight days with no food and no water. But it's also about the redemptive power of love and striving for something higher. I learned that you can overcome anything now with, you know, the right attitude, determination, and faith. Hollywood turning an Olympian's real story of survival. What do you want from me? Into a big screen inspirational movie. With this week's Going for the Gold, I'm Aaron Nolan. And set on your sides, Lex Gray is heading to the Olympic Games this February. She'll provide a unique perspective on the ground in Pyeongchang, South Korea. We have a page dedicated to the 2018 Winter Olympics up on wavy.com. It's really easy to find. You can find it under the sports tab.